Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Seasons uh, Generations Edition. I'm Landros and i um, got a problem here with Amber. She won't actually take care of her baby. Um, yeah, my uh, looks like Seth just peed all over himself. Amber, I tried to get you to go upstairs and take care of this, but she didn't do it. Um, okay, good. Looks like Miles is going to take care of Well, maybe he is. I don't know. Now, one thing I did notice is that poor Tyler and Miles are wearing the same everyday clothes. So once Tyler gets home, he was actually uh, hanging out over at the school. I'm going to send him upstairs, and I'm going to change his everyday wear because that was not something I intended to do. But let me go ahead and make sure that he knows he needs to plan his outfit. Uh, Roman's over here. <laughs> He's invisible, and he is supposedly taking care of the garden. Um, I hope you're doing it. This is the second LP where I've had an invisible person, so I may have to just go and have him uh, take a shower or something and get him back. Okay, yeah, whatever. Let's go ahead and take care of Tyler real quick. And it's only his everyday clothes that I have to worry about. Normally I would not do this on camera because the music gets too loud, but we're going to try to do this quickly, and we're going to pick something. Yeah, I got the baggy jeans on him because I like the baggy jeans. Um, let's go ahead and take a look here. All right, that's all Showtime stuff. I think that's all pets. This is Generations. And if we wanted to, that doesn't really look okay. That's not bad. I can I can live with that. Um, just double checking. No, I don't really like the long sleeves underneath. I'd rather have the short sleeves. So let's go ahead and go with that. I'm assuming that's generations, if I'm not mistaken. Um, you know me. I can always be wrong. Okay, and just to look again to see if there's any pants with generations. There are these pants. No. That's even worse. Okay. Okay, that gives him something. It's a little different. Um, and I don't think I'm using it instead of using the baggy jeans, but I don't like the dark. And the blue's too much. So yeah, it needs a contrast, so we'll go with the white. Alright, I'm going to leave him with that. Okay. Tyler. We got some things to do with you. You are, you are somebody I'm curious about because we don't have any aliens in any of my games. So, what I want to do is I want to look at your skills real quick. Um, yeah, if you get an alien that you actually invite to move into the household, they end up actually um, having a much higher level of um, handiness and logic. But of course, ours was born into it, so it really doesn't matter. Okay. He could actually give her a boost. I think it can boost her power. Let's go ahead and see. Um, where are you, Tyler? Okay, let's see if we can give her a bio boost. Now, of course, she should be getting it from wherever he is. Oh, there he is. Now, let's take a look and see how she does. Okay, yeah, so that does actually boost her energy up. And then over the next hour or so, she's going to actually increase. Um see anybody else Roman needed a boost too so Roman all right can't really click on you okay I guess you're gonna go here and go to bed I can't click on you because oh there you go finally uh, you can't brain boost him I guess he's too gone too far gone oh yeah he's already doing it now he can kind of like meditating he can restore his own brain power oh wait, he was doing homework wasn't he I don't want to mess with that do your homework Oh, Lord, here goes the kids. Okay, get your homework done. Where's your multi-tab? Do you not have a multi-tab? Okay, you and Stacy don't have... I don't think Stacy has one either. Uh, before I go in here and do this, I know, I know. Stacy, do you have one? No, you don't have one. I know Miles does. Yeah, Miles does, and I think the other kids, they don't have them. Well, we really can't afford that many of them. We can. Might as well go ahead and do them now, that way I don't ever have to think about it again. So, we need to go ahead and get to the computers. Okay, Stacy, that's you. Tyler, that's you. Seth, and Trish. Okay, you guys all now have your own multi-tab. Tyler, you're going to come over here and pick this one up, and you can do your homework on it. Stacy, I'm sure you already did your homework, but you can go ahead and listen to... Let's go ahead and listen to Charisma. And then you can't do anything with yours, so I'm going to go ahead and just stick it in here anyway. Well, if I can. Are you too young to have one? Or maybe that's the one that's being used. Oh, well, that's just wrong. Okay, well, then it looks like Mom's going to have to hold on to yours for you until you can use it. Actually, she needs one herself, so Mom, you just got one. Does she already have one? 
Okay, may maybe she did, and I just wasn't even realizing it. All right, well, we fed extra ones, so in case we have another child, which I don't know that that's going to happen. He's already got one. Miles, you've already got one. Okay, so that's okay. Um, no, stay, that's Amber, so I'm sorry. Hello, I don't even know who I'm looking at. Okay, so she didn't have one. So it looks like we just have one ex uh, two extras that will be for the kids when they grow up. Let me give this not to Miles. Let me give it to Amber. Mom's going to hang on to all this, and then you guys can take care of it. Okay. Stacy, what do we need to work on with you? We need to find this stupid moth. So let's go up here and let's take a look. Moth, if you're not out here, I'm going to get very frustrated with you. Not that I'm not already, but she should, it should show up. And I'm looking. I know sometimes I miss it. I'm very blind. But I still don't see it. And I'm thinking that maybe it's something that once they actually age up, then it's too late. And uh, yeah, she's probably working out. That's fine. You can do what you got to do. Okay, so there's nothing we can work on for her opportunity there, but she's wanting to work out. Let's see, you want to snuggle Seth. Well, where is Seth? He's in Mom's arms. So Mom, put Seth down. Go ahead and put Seth down here. Oh yeah, you guys are having a good time. And then Stacy, instead of staying up all night getting all nasty and smelly, go ahead and let's take care of a wish. Go ahead and snuggle him. Okay, and then what else do you want to do? You want to talk to Roman and chat with Seth. Well gonna have to just do the things with Seth because Roman's in bed. Okay, Tyler, can't really do anything with him. You could pick up Seth, but you're going up to take a shower. Amber, crazy lady, you're tired. Um, you're not friends with your son? Everybody wants to talk with Seth. Is he just like the conversationalist or something? I mean, man. Oh, poor little girl. Let's go find out where she is. Okay, you go ahead, come up here, you're going to feed this baby. What else does she need? Oh, she needs to go to the bathroom too. And once you do that, you might as well clean up. This is from Tyler's mess. He left it when I told him to go on. So it was my fault. It wasn't his. All right. Stacy, I'm going to let you go ahead and come on up here and go to bed because you're tired. He's not tired at all. He's going to be fine. I might as well just let him, when he gets done, discover another potion. Miles, you're out. You're actually in bed. You're good. And then, oh, somebody's got to take care of Seth. Um, Stacy, before you do that, I'm sorry to make you go all the way back downstairs again, but we can't leave the baby down here. We could, but probably wouldn't be the smartest thing. Why don't you go ahead and put Seth in the crib, and then I'll let you go to bed. Yeah, it's a lot of work to get them all where they need to be. Amber, I know, I know, I know. Okay. And this little baby, she's getting her food taken care of. Then she needs to go ahead, and I don't want to stop her yet. Go ahead and eat. Okay, finish up eating. Shouldn't take you that long. She's got two hours, so she's going to pee herself. But she's not going to pee herself. We're going to take care of that. Okay, go ahead and do this. And then, Mom, when you come back up, we're going to actually go ahead and we're going to, we're going to give her a bath. Not you. We're going to bathe. We're going to bathe Trish. And I bet he probably needed to be. Oh, no, he was fine. He's hungry. Stacy. Sorry, you're going to have to feed him on the floor. You're never going to get to bed. I promise you, this is it. This is the last time. The mom is going to have to do the rest of this. Okay, Tyler, you're up to level five. That's pretty good. Um, let's go ahead and see how she does this. I know we've done this a couple of times. but Please don't take him downstairs. Please just stop. Oh, you've got to be kidding. So, okay, well, we're going to be going up and downstairs. That's the only problem, having all this stuff. It blocks all this room. He has plenty of room, but it makes him do this. All right, well, Seth is just getting hungry. I'm so glad we did this now. Oh, Amber's hungry, too, so she might as well eat when she goes downstairs. But she's tired. She's more tired than she is hungry. Okay, is this baby good? This baby's good. Put her in the crib. Oh, no, 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 no. Put her in the crib. Did I tell her to snuggle? No, I did. I told her to put her in the crib. You're going up to bed. You, you're just sitting there eating as happy as can be. Um... Amber, we'll get you we'll get you fed and then we'll get you to put Seth in the crib. I promise you, this is just Whoa! Okay. <laughs> Crazy mouse. It wasn't me, I promise. Uh, yeah, right. Okay, you're gonna go ahead and put him in the crib. Oh, stop it. You know what? You don't have that many reasons to be upset. Actually Tyler could come down and do this, so let's let Tyler take care of you. Go ahead and uh, that will actually take care of this one because he wanted to hold or pick him up. No yeah, he wanted to pick him up. Um, so you want to do anything else with Seth? No. 
and then he's going to go ahead and put him in the crib. Amber, you don't have to deal with your son. You just have to eat, and then we'll get you upstairs and go to bed. Where's Roman? Okay, so there we go. Okay, I'm so glad to have an alien that doesn't have to sleep. This is nice. I mean, yeah, he needs the brain power, but we can get some stuff done. When you have an alien in your household, it's a good thing. Now I'm kind of wishing I could get all of my, my men to stay outside at between 12 and 3 a.m. and get pregnant, because this would help, especially on my big families. Okay, Tyler, everything else is good. <laughs> you could have gone down and eaten, but you know, I'm not gonna let you eat right now. I'm gonna go ahead and let you continue discovering potions, and then you can eat later. Don't interrupt her. You interrupted him. Go ahead and do that. Okay, the kids are knocked out. Uh, the older kids, they're fine. So everybody's good. That was an awful lot. I'll wear you out right there. Okay, he needs to go find all these things. And I'm going to look just because I want to make sure I did. But I don't see anything. It's 1.30 in the morning. I see absolutely nothing that is spawning for him. So I really think that we just need to cancel those out. So to me, I'm just tired of looking for them. It was a great thing to do. We should have done it when they were little. I shouldn't have let everything else get in our way. But there's no reason to actually hold on to this. So I'm making that call right now. Gone. Stacy, that's gone for you too. Miles, you don't have to do it, do you? No, you don't have any special opportunities. Does she have anything? Oh, yeah, she does. Um, you want to get fatigued twice. So we got to do that. And you... Oh, poor guy. Now he... Does he get... Yeah, he gets singed. Okay, go in there take a shower. Leisure day's coming. Oh, yeah, it's summertime. I wish they had the summer off from school. Okay. Where was that? Roman, you've got to go attend a conference at the office. It's due by Tuesday at 2 o'clock. Oh, man. We didn't do it. Um, what time is your job? In seven hours. Oh, this is going to stink. But if I make him take the day off, we wouldn't get any money, but he could get that done. What does it come with? This promises a raise for all the doctors that attend the conference. And how close is he? Yeah, we're going to take the day off. And that way we can attend the conference and he'll get a raise. So when you get up, you're going to go ahead and take um, one day. That's all you need. I don't normally do that because I don't, I don't want them to lose out on money, but the fact that he'll get a definite raise on this actually helps, and we should have done this before. Again, wasn't paying attention because there's too many people for me to pay attention to. Tyler, you got all that done? No, you want to go eat, don't you? Yeah, I'm going to let you eat, and let's see what else you want. You want Tickle Trish, which is good, Discover a Star. Um... We don't have a hopscotch squad. I'm going to have to cancel out of that. These two we can do. Oh, now she's up. And she's probably going to be up all night. No, she had to go to sleep. Wish there was an action say knock her out. But that doesn't happen. Okay, Roman. You're getting really nasty. Um, let's get you over here. We're going to use this. We're going to take a shower. <laughs> Whatever. And then I'll get you downstairs to eat. Maybe Tyler will do good on this cooking right here. They need some stuff in this kitchen. It's it's big, but it's plain. Yeah, we really need some things. But at least they have a nice stove, nice oven, nice uh, refrigerator. So there's something there. But yeah, i got to get them some stuff to work with. Okay, you want to snuggle Seth. Nobody wants to do anything with Trish? Come on. Oh, wait, finally. Pick up Trish. Let's see, what about you? Oh, you're already locked in with all your stuff. You don't have anything extra to put in there. Okay, and you guys can't do anything. Okay, fine. Come on, Tyler, fix this, and then you need to clean this up too, but I don't want to lock you. I don't want to stop you from doing what you're doing. And hopefully, yeah, this is a good stove, so you should actually turn out um, learning the skill a lot faster, and you shouldn't burn or, or um, start a fire with it. Did you serve, or did you just make it for yourself? Okay, looks like you served. Very good. All right, you're going to come down here, and you're going to go ahead and have some of these waffles, and then you can put it away. Since you didn't cook them, you can actually help out. Tyler, you need to go to the bathroom. Your hygiene's good. Let's see, what else do you want to do? You want to tickle Trish? Well, since she's up, let's 
get that taken care of. Where's Tickle? There's Tickle. Okay, you're going to tickle her, and then I guess you probably ought to go ahead and use the bathroom, which I know is awful. You ought to unclog it. Okay, his, his request has been approved, so you've got the day off. But that doesn't mean that we're not going to go do something with you. You're going to actually get this thing taken care of. Um, I'm assuming you do it in business hours. Whoa, what was that? Did you? I'm sure you guys saw it. It was all bright and lit up by the festival. I don't know what it meant, but that's okay. Now let's see what time we can come. Between 10 o'clock and 2 o'clock on Saturday and Sunday. Oh, it doesn't matter anyway. I'm such an idiot. Okay, well, I missed it. And we took the day off, so that's okay. Do we have anything else that we got to get done? Probably not. We'll work on his logic and all that stuff. So apparently we just messed up. Oh, and he got pranked. Uh, if I would have looked at that, it would have helped. I should have done that. But no, I didn't. Okay. You got school coming up, don't you? Okay, you want to snuggle, Seth? Tell you what, Roman. Yeah, I don't really want to mess with you right now. Oh, he's eating, so he's good. And when you get done, you might as well do the same thing. Um, go ahead and use this, and then you can take a shower. Well, that's what that's what you get when you got teenagers in the house. Come on, it wasn't that bad. Okay, she is actually she's off in her own little world. She doesn't care. Can somebody put the baby in the bed? Yes, you can. Go ahead and put her in the crib. Where are you going? Are you really needing to get up right now? Yeah, you are, because you got to go to work. Um, might as well go ahead and use the bathroom. Take a real quick shower. Everything else is good. Okay. Seth is all right. Um, well, this will be fine. Amber can go on to work, and then we'll let Roman take care of the kids today. Miles, what is your problem today? Okay. Miles, I need to stop you before you do this. We don't need to actually do the shower first. We need to use the bathroom first. So let me get you over here. Uh, I guess because I had you, um, I had Tyler in there. That's what was doing it. Okay, Tyler, you got that taken care of. Why don't you give Amber, let's see, stop. I know, I know, I know. Go ahead and give her a bio boost because she's got to go to work. What's wrong? You can't see through it? Maybe now you can. Okay, it's Trisha's birthday. I hope we got everything done. And it's Roman's birthday. And it's Seth's birthday. It's a birthday kind of a day. Alright, so we're helping out with Amber. Gave her a boost. Let's see how she's doing. Well, it should have increased her energy, but I guess it's not going... Well, it actually increased something. Um... You guys, what is he going to do? He's going to go clean it. Good for him. Stacy, you are hungry. Let's get you downstairs. But before you do that, why don't you go ahead and... So you can't use that bathroom. Maybe you can use the one downstairs. Oh, that's nasty. It's nasty as can be. All right, you go ahead and use that one. And then you can go ahead and eat some of those waffles. Roman, you're not going to play games. I'm sorry. You might as well go over here. And let's put Seth in the swing. And then you can put Trish in the swing. That gets you something to do. We don't have to worry about you for a few minutes. Okay, you, when you get done with this, you need to eat, and then I'm going to make Roman clean. Roman needs to do this. Poor Amber's been doing this for so long. Um, let's see. I don't know what she needs to do. Oh, charisma and logic. She doesn't have either one. Might as well just um, hang with your coworkers a little bit. Do the best you can, because I really didn't work on you at all. Okay, Roman, you're doing this. Um, what are you guys doing? Rome, oh, okay, is he doing his homework? No, reading predictions of the future. Tyler, you're just sitting there. You want to chat with your brother? Okay, well, you go ahead and do that because you don't have much time. I think you've got, oh, you, you've got a little bit of time. Um, what do you need? You could go discover a star. You wouldn't have enough time. Picking these guys up now. Probably not. Let's see. Who's in the... He's down here. Go snuggle him. Oh, wait, she's going to turn him on. All right, Tyler, you're just on your... You're just going to have to just sit there and then enjoy doing nothing because we're going to actually be leaving to go to school. 
yeah, it starts in an hour, so I don't really want to waste your time. Okay, there's the Simfest at Verde Park. Oh yeah, I forgot we put that in here, didn't we? What's he doing now? You make it go slow? You're, you're really nice. You can't do anything with him, can you? You can bio-boost him. Let's do that. Very nice. Okay, Roman, go ahead and turn this on slow. Do you have enough to do with this one? No. Nope, you don't have enough. Why don't you chat with... Uh, actually, you know, you don't, it's Stacy that needs to chat with him. So why don't you stop it, Miles. Stop it. You're not working out. You're not skipping school either. You guys got to go. All of you got to go. Get to school. I cannot believe you guys are going to skip school. Did the bus not show up? Stacy, stop it. You cannot afford this. Trust me. Yeah, I know he's upset with it. She's trying to go. Why don't you let her go? Alright, I guess you're going to have to let her off the hook. Did you ground her? Yeah, let her off the hook so she can go to school. And guess what? You guys are going to have to work hard now because... Fine. Here I am trying. This is why I probably should have sent them off to boarding school because they are just messing up. Okay, Roman. Glad you're home. You're going to actually go ahead and unclog this and then I'm going to let you clean it because that is just disgusting. Kids are fine. They'll take care of themselves in the swing. Um, I hope we taught them all how to walk and talk. I really didn't look. Let's, let's take a look. Um, yeah, I think he's good because he went to the bathroom already. And she. Yeah, she's good. So they're going to age up. They're going to be fine. You're going to get this done. And hopefully you can clean this thing up and make it look decent. And we need to work on your logic skills. So before you clean, I'm going to let you start listening to logic. Let's get that up as much as we can. Uh, what else do you have to have for your job? Oh, we got to have that research read too. So go ahead and clean that. Do you have any research books? You've got a medical beeper and you've got this one. You need to read that one. Can you read and do this at the same time? I hope you can. Man, he has not done well. Okay, then when you're done, you're going to snuggle Seth before he starts crying. So get on over here and do this. Of course, you're probably going to be reading for a while, so that's okay. Let's see how long it's going to take before Seth and Trish get all upset. Okay, <laughs> yeah, they're, they're doing okay for now, but they're about to actually lose it. Let's get this journal read, and then we'll be... Alright, we're good. Um, you want to catch a fish? Sure, why not? Okay, once you do that, go ahead and turn her on slow. We're probably going to have to put, her back, put him back into the crib once you actually take her out of the swing. Okay, put Seth in the swing. Let's do that. And then you can turn her on slow. Oh, we got somebody at the house. Go away. Who do we who do we have here at the house? Outside reading. Absolutely, you can read that. It'll help you help your stuff. Let's go ahead and do a friendly introduction and we can invite her inside. Maybe she'll help. Probably won't. Okay, let's take a look at his job needs right now. Okay, that actually helped out quite a bit. But he still needs this logic taken care of. And of course, interacting with her is not going to help. So, let's get him going back on this logic tab cast again. Where's logic? Okay, you do that. And then, uh, no, we're not going to France. And to tell you what, why don't you go ahead and play chess with this crazy lady that just shows up. And that way, you guys are actually taking care of this. Who's coming in the door? Um, random animal just just walking in the house. Don't you pee on the floor. It must be her dog. Uh huh. He says, yeah, she's a witch. Don't trust her. All right, I got gotcha. you. Okay, good. He can actually listen to this and it's keeping them occupied. Okay, yeah, we didn't get there on time. I knew that, but I tried. Actually, I didn't. <laughs> That's the whole point. Okay, Miles, you want to go to the sporting event at the school. Let me go to the school real quick with you because I don't want you leaving. Um, that's where it's going to be. We're going to go ahead and do this now. 
And Tyler, are you going to have to do it? I hope you do. I guess not. Um, we've got activities already going on with you. Stacy, you're on your way home. How did you guys do on your, on your grades? Let me just double check you real quick. Okay, she's up to a B, but that's good. Um, it was a lot better than it was. Okay, Roman, you're up to level 7. Keep going. We need to stop you in just a minute. And Amber, I bet you're home already. Well, you're on your way. Let's see, she needs to work on charisma and logic. So when we get home, we're going to have her start listening to her tab cast. Who's in the car with her? Oh, she's in a carpool. I was going to say, who are you taking? Okay, so you're going to go ahead and you're going to listen to... Let's work on charisma. Like I really care too much. Well, you know, you are still a young adult, so I've got to kind of help push you along. I'm going to let you serve up something new. <laughs> we don't know anything new because I don't ever go to the grocery store and get, or the bookstore and get recipes. Oh, yikes. Goopy carbonara. But before you do that, let's, let's get you guys some stuff. Small appliances. Um, you definitely need a food processor. Um, it doesn't really matter which one. I don't think they have... Well, this will help your cooking, so we'll go with that one. Oh, wait, you've already got one. Okay, so I thought you had... Okay, I guess you got more. It just looks like you don't have a whole lot. Uh, you guys need a beverage maker. Though what I ought to do, and this is bad, because I always complain about it, but if I get you guys this thing, which is a deep fryer, and I get you the ice cream maker... Okay, we better turn this thing around so they can use it. Or is that the way? Is that the right way? Is that the ice cream maker? I swear it doesn't look like it. No, it's the, the beverage maker. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. Um, where are you? Right there? No, 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 no. I swear I saw it. It was right there. It's right there. So I knew it was white. Um, can it get any closer to that thing? I don't want to take up all their counter space because they need it to cook. And that way they won't all be crowding in the same place. Okay. Oh, good. We got 500 lifetime points just for having the complete kitchen. I would like to get them the beverage maker, but which one do we want? That's pretty expensive. But we'll wait. I'm going to let them actually get a little bit more because we still don't have a car. Um, but this way they can do this. And Amber, why don't you go ahead and you can serve up. Let's serve up some deep fried chicken. So no goopy carbonara tonight. Put it down. Put the carbonara away. I wish I would have stopped you before. Then go ahead and clean that up. We don't need it. Okay. Miles, you got that one. Stacy, hopefully you're doing your homework because I really don't want to have to mess with this. Oh, good, you are. Miles, are you doing yours? Yes, I think he is. Yep. Oh, and that's not Tyler. Hello. Miles, oh, who are you talking to? Oh, you got a water balloon fight with somebody. This isn't your little romantic interest either, so, hey. Miles, you're finding somebody. Who is that? Diane Beatty. Oh, she's a little too old for you. Although, you are about to age up. Why did you go to school dressed up in a tux? Are you just that crazy? Do you have an insane trait? No. Um, kind of weird. That's okay. You go ahead and play. I'm not going to bother with you right now. Um, tell you what, I'm going to go ahead and take this out and let you... We're going to do that tomorrow anyway. Or actually Thursday. Amber, what's wrong with you? Oh, you're exhausted. Well, no wonder. Um, Tyler, can you give her a boost? Yeah, let's see if we can boost her up a little bit. Is that helping? Didn't do anything for energy. Uh, I was kind of hoping it would. But I don't really know how that works. Now, I know he can do some different things as an alien. Um, but I don't think he can do too much of it until he actually gets up to be a young adult. Oh, wait, that's, that's the wrong person. Um, but he can do some things. He can scan an object. I don't know what object you're going to scan, but let's go do it. But I know he can do some really cool things as an alien, and I'm looking forward to actually being able to play around with that. And we need to go out there and pay the bills, because I know they came. I just want to see what he's going to go scan. Oh, that's all you're going to do? Okay, well, that didn't really do much. Can you do anything with this stuff besides... Plant it. 
No. About this thing. No, you can't really do any of that. Okay, so we didn't get any any kind of message or anything that tells us what it is. You can restore your own brain power, though. Oh, his hygiene went down pretty low. Now, apparently this is supposed to be like the meditation skill in World Adventures, where you can do it on your own. But it comes at a cost, so he's lost a lot of his hygiene. I don't know where he's got to go to do this. Okay, yeah, so it does look very much like the, um, he's in a meditative stance, or trance, so that's fine. Okay, did you get your homework done already? Yes, you did. You're good. No wonder. You guys were probably would have done just fine, except the fact I didn't have multi-tabs for you. Okay, Tyler, when you're done, which that's not going to be too much longer, um, I'm going to let you go ahead and use this. Let's see, we're going to take a shower. And then he needs to eat. Oh, man, I can already hear it. Where's the chicken that she made? Oh, it's right there. Um, react to the noise you see. Okay, well, you go ahead and react to her. What are we doing with her? Okay, everybody, I'm not going to mess with you guys because it looks like you're taking care of all of it. Oh, all we need is a full moon. Okay, I'm leaving the crazy house. I'm leaving the house because it's too much. It's really not. But I'm going to come over here and check on Miles. He needs to get this taken care of. Okay, Miles, did you get the homework finished? I think you did. No, you're close. Can you finish it up? Yeah, you're finishing. I'll stay with you. Oh, man, you're already done. Okay, we need to go ahead and go on home. Wait, before you go home, don't show anybody that you came dressed to school like that. Let's go ahead and switch clothes. Okay, much better. Like, I have no idea why you went to school that way, but it works for you. It's a beautiful day, and it's um, it would have been a great day to go out and do something else, but unfortunately school got in the way, and taking care of kids got in the way. The nice thing, though, is that we're going to have some birthdays, and I believe it's going to be, finally, the toddlers are going to be aged up, and I believe it was, was it Trish? Somebody else is having a birthday today. No, it must be, maybe it's Roman. No, it's Roman today. Okay. So, good deal. We should be getting the... The kids should be aging up in about an hour. And then Roman probably in about three hours. We could do it on their own and have it have it done. But, I kind of like to let the system do it. Okay. Now, I don't have... For some reason, the, uh, the Sims 3 website is down today. I've been trying to get on, and it won't come on. So, what we're going to do is go ahead and let Roman... Oh, Roman, are you going to cook something, too? Of course you are. Uh, Miles, you don't have anything to do. Come over here and pay the bills. And let's go ahead and get the mail as well and see what we got. What was that one? Send a love letter? No. So I can't accept gifts, which is unfortunate because I'd love to see if we got any gifts for this family. They're the ones who really, really need it. And maybe the maybe it'll come back pretty soon, but right now it has not been up and available for us. Okay, we still have enough money. We're not hurting. Tyler, buddy. Okay, how bad are you? Okay, this witch needs to leave. I mean that with love. All right, you just need to get out of here. There's too many people to mess with. Okay, this is good. Now we don't have to worry too much about making them eat because they're going to come over here and they're going to gravitate towards this all day long. I'm going to put this in here. And that way I don't have to worry about it because it'll go bad otherwise. What are you doing? Okay. And what does she need? Oh, her bladder's about to die, about to go. Um, good deal. Finally, they're going to age up, and then she can take care of her own bathroom needs. Okay, it's Seth's birthday. Very nice. Uh, Amber, the dog is not your baby. Why don't you come over here and watch your baby have a birthday? Here we go. All right, and then Seth. Okay, because of our excellent parenting skills, we can choose a new trait for him to develop. Um, what are we going to get? He's brave. He's friendly. He's adventurous. I like it. Okay. That's a little cute little kid there. Okay. I'll even leave the hair. It's nice. Okay. So hopefully next we're going to have... There you go. Trish is going to age up too. Now Trish, this is a good time for you because you can take care of your own needs. And then we can get rid of some of this baby stuff in the house. That'll be, that'll be really nice. Unfortunately, this now means we got to find a place for you to sleep. And... Um, are you guys still... Okay, now it's Miles over there with the deep fryer. Okay. Let's see, and because of our good traits, we can actually... Or skills, we can choose something. Loves the cold, disciplined. 
I don't like eco friendly. Perfectionist I can live with. Okay. Oh, well, she's pretty. She actually looks very much like her mom. Okay, so why don't you go ahead and take care of your bathroom needs? You know how to do that by now. Okay, maybe you don't. So let me go ahead and tell you to do it because you're going to actually pee all over yourself. Roman, get out of her way. You don't want to be standing in that mess. Okay. What are you? Oh, it's his birthday. Okay, that's what it's like. What are you doing? All right, so Roman, you're about to age up and be a full-fledged adult, which I can't believe it's taken this long. But again, I did have the time, the age span set really long. But now they're back to a more normal time. So he doesn't look any different. He's still the same, uh, but he does now need to start establishing himself in his career while he has some time. Let's see if there's a midlife crisis. Doesn't look like it. Okay, I didn't hear the midlife crisis music. Oh, little girl. <laughs> I told you. I knew it was coming. Alright, you go ahead and go take a shower. Sorry, the birthday did kind of get you. Uh, Amber, what's wrong with you? You're tired? Okay, before we do anything, i got to go ahead and get you guys somewhere to sleep. That's bad. Um, I guess we're just going to put in another set of beds over here. Alright, well... Toy chest is gonna have to go in here for now. Um, I like having that there, but and this really fit right here quite well. But we can actually move this maybe over here. Will it go in this corner? Of course not. That would have been just too easy. Maybe it slides over one more. No, it won't. You sure? You sure you won't go? It's probably because there's a window or something in front. Yeah, I think so. Man. Okay, well, if I flip you around this way, will you fit? Okay, you'll fit that way. That's fine. Um, we really don't need another set of twin beds or double beds. But, you know, we might as well just go ahead. Um, what did I do that for? Okay, why is it flipping me over? All right, I guess we don't want to get twin beds. Let's Or um, bunk beds. Let's go with... Not that I like those. They're all the same. Um, yeah. Let me try one more time. I just want to keep them. Fine. It's like, why would it not work for me? Okay. This way, if by chance we decide to have yet another kid, which I don't think that's going to happen, we would have a place for them. Okay. Now this oven can go over here. I hope. Um, this thing has got to go over here. I'm going to put this in the boys' room for now. It's just moving things around, and let's see, we're going to actually double. I know these beds are not that great, but it's what we got. It's what we're dealing with. Okay, mom and dad need a better bed. This is pitiful. Since they are, I'm going to set this over here for now. Um, what do I want? I was actually on the beds already. Um, we don't have a whole lot of money, but this is a bed you could pass down, and I love this one. I'm using it in most of my households because it actually gives you quite a bit. Let's see, it's a level, it's energy 10. I don't think there's any other ones that are quite that much. Well, that one is, but $200 difference. Hmm, we could go with that one. That'd be different, but it's more money. How much is this one? Energy 4, oh, that's a love bed. That's why it's so expensive. Um, you guys could go with this one. Stress relief of 4 versus stress relief of 3. Yeah, let's go with this one. Okay, I may have to start using this one. It's got a little bit better um, deal with it. Let's see. don't want to go with the pink one. I think this one might match better. It's really bland, but it's... Whoa, it's very bright. Okay. Let's turn that light. Okay. It's glowing. Let's see if I can actually turn this light down. Let's set it down to normal for this room. Okay, still too bright. Set it down for dim on this room. Okay, that's a little bit better. I know it might be kind of dark, but otherwise it's really too bright. Um, maybe if I just get rid of this light altogether. I gotta get rid of this one. And then we'll go with some lamps instead. Okay, this light, this one needs to go. Um, let's see what we can put in here. Let's 
go with this one right here. I'll stop it. I'm not ready yet. Okay, and then we're going to go ahead and I'm going to use another one, but what was this? Oh, it's just a little plant. Can it fit up there? Yes, it can. So it should have fit on the other side. Another lamp over here. And then we're going to get rid of a couple of things. I don't want to get rid of them because if we don't have kids with Amber and Roman, I know the other kids are going to have children. So we're going to go ahead and put all this stuff away. And we'll use it another time. Um, at least we don't have to have it out right now. Let's see, we got one more of these. And i got to go downstairs and make sure I get the baby swings. Okay, this one can go over here where it was. And let's see, that couch can go back. Okay. And then at this point, what I'm going to do is go ahead and get them one more light. I think I'm going to go with a floor light, a floor lamp. Wonder, do we have any in the inventory? No. I sell them off too quickly. Okay, so let's look at the floor lamps again. Um, nothing too fancy. Just want something that'll work. This one right here is fine. It's kind of kind of silly there, but yeah, that, that'll work. And it gives us a little bit of light here and a light, little bit of light here. See, that's a little bit too bright. Okay, so I'm good with that. Let's go downstairs. Let's get these things put away. And you're gone. Okay, is there anything else that just screams out baby? I don't think so. I think we got all the baby stuff out. I'm hoping we did. Um, upstairs. Can I put this somewhere else? No, I really can't. I wish I could, but I could put it on that wall, but it kind of blocks the view of everything, so I'm just going to leave it where it is. Alright, sounds like a plan. we got a place for everybody. What I need to do is go ahead and make sure everybody knows where to sleep. You are kind of tired. I'm going to get everybody in bed. It's going to be an early night. Um, Amber, you don't know where to sleep, do you? Go over here and go to sleep. Miles, you know where your bed is. Oh, but you're doing homework, I think. No, you're just reading, so go to sleep. Stacy, you know where your bed is. I know some of you need the bathroom and whatnot. Tyler, I'm going to go ahead and just put you here. I know you don't need to sleep, so I'll let you get back up in just a minute. But I just want everybody to know where to go. And you need to go here. Okay, so Tyler, since you really don't need to sleep, you can actually come up here and you can discover a potion. And lady, go home! Don't you see the rest of the family going to bed? It's time for you to leave. Oh, I forgot to get the... Uh, what was that? You dropped it? Poor guy. I need to put the baby monitors away. That's what I forgot. Okay, the, the lady and her dog need to leave. It's going to take them forever to get up these stairs. Come on, Trish. Okay, Miles, do you still know what you're supposed to go do? Yeah, you do. And I should have put that toy away. Can I drag it? Yes, I can. Good deal. Alright, so it looks like everybody is finding their beds. And they should get a decent night's sleep. Yeah, the zombies. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, you don't. Um, lock this. Everybody... Wait, it should be everybody. Should everybody should be in there. Okay, let's unlock and then let's lock it again. Okay, I don't want the zombie over there eating our plants. And we need a we need an actual pea shooter over here, but I don't have one yet for him. Okay, zombie, let me make sure you don't go in here. Otherwise, I'm gonna be very angry with you. So far, I don't think she's going to. I think she's just gonna walk around the house. All right, what I'm gonna just go ahead and end the part here. When we come back. We'll pick, up, pick back up with uh, the rest of the family and see what we can get them doing for Tuesday. Um, it'll be another busy day. Roman will go back to work and hopefully make some more money. Oh, good. Tyler, you've discovered something. Is that your first one or is your second one? I think that's your second. I really do. That's, no, it's your third. Okay, good. At least you actually have a few that you know how to do. Fantastic. Okay, guys, I'll be back next time, but um, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode.